How many are we having? Well, do we need more? I usually have three eggs at least. Okay, Harsh is not having, he already had food. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, so three each. Three each. But when she made me laugh, don't do that to my tune. My love is not hard to be in a place where life is easy. Like, what the fuck is real? What the fuck is wrong? <laughs> Did you just eat it? One, yeah. <laughs> what? I want to get what? Atherosclerosis. Med students be like. Why are you always here to break bread? Think about the way that you can feel it get percent. Jokes on you. I'm really proud of the fact that I cook that because normally I don't cook my own food. Shout out, mom. So now let's eat it and see how it is. There you go. This is my teeth whitening kit from High Smile. Don't open this. There you go. I just put on my shoes and normally I would record it to get to mad B roll, but me and Archer are late. Jokes on you. One minute, Archie. We gotta run. We gotta run. We gotta run. This is my story of my life. We gotta run. We gotta run. We gotta run. Scan it and go. And hold the doors. Do you know how to do that? Oh shit! This is entertaining content. But when she made me laugh, doom doom back to my tomb. I love it my heart to be in a place where life is easy. Like what the fuck is real? What the fuck is wrong? I think I can fit with your tone like. Absolutely hate filming B-roll. Absolutely hate it, especially in the city in public. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I know I haven't filmed in a while, but none of you care about that. This is Archer. Oh. We're here today uh, in the city to go watch some Australian Open. We did some work in the morning. It's very loud here, so you guys are gonna be very close to my face. At the moment, we're looking for a nice place for lunch and Archer doesn't want to have anything he can have anywhere because he's actually from Adelaide. Just revealed his privacy. So we're trying to look for some local Melbourne food. If you guys know any local Melbourne food places, leave them in the comments down below. We just got ice cream and not just card to climb. How is it? How is it? I haven't tried it. All right, try it. Good. I'm gonna try the top one though. Oh, it's not even plastic, it's like paper thing. Yep, it's decent. I love ice cream too much to try record right now, so I'm just gonna eat my ice cream. I absolutely smashed through my ice cream while Arch is still trying to finish his. What are we rating the ice cream in Melbourne? Uh, You'll be give louder. It, give it like an eight. I'll give it like a seven. Because I haven't been to other places, other countries, you know. Oh, what? So, you gotta so, leave. No, you, you can't, like... Yeah, you have to, like... But you don't know what 10 is, then. 10 is just, like... 10 is your best, not... not. 10 is, like, something that, like, I drink, and it just makes me stop and sit down and reflect. Like, I journal about who made this ice cream, and I go have a conversation with the owner. But you don't even know if that's possible. We hope. We're here at the Australian Open, though. So let me tell you guys how we're gonna get tickets. Archer bought a thousand dollar NFT, which is a picture of a tennis ball for a thousand dollars that basically gives him ground passes to the Australian Open forever. Until I sell it. Un until he sells it. So yeah, let's see if we can get inside. We made it inside. Game point right now. I'm treating this as a mic. Say hello. Hello. Wins. Pressure. They can't see.
apparently GoPros aren't allowed at the Australian Open, but I brought mine in anyway. So I don't want to get it confiscated. So I'm like afraid to, afraid to extend my arm and record like this. Yo, so we went to the casino uh, and I couldn't film in there because I don't know, I don't know the rules and stuff. However, Archer broke even and I made a $10 profit at my first time ever at a casino. And now we're going home. We're gonna head home now, uh, change, shower. I'm all sunscreened up, I hate sunscreen, but because I live in Australia and the sun is an absolute bleep, we have to put on sunscreen, unless we're gonna get burnt and get skin cancer. So go home, have a shower, and then I think we're gonna head to an Indian restaurant for dinner, because Archer loves Indian food. Uh, and here in the eat one Indian food. What is that dish? Butter chicken. Butter chicken, so we'll, we'll get some butter chicken and see how that is. Like, what the fuck is real? What the fuck is wrong? I think I can fit. With your tongue like Oh, I think about you Compare with my body When the time it comes through Laughing on you Till the time it comes through I did not take a water bottle to Australian Open And it was really hot And I didn't really drink a lot of water And I've been waiting since the entire train ride I was hoping to get home So I can drink some water So I'm gonna get my reaction of drinking this water It's about to be great Amazing. Melbourne water is amazing. Gamer. How did you join Samoa's club? What I do? You buy the one you choose. And it's just How one? You come to join Stop! So we came to an Indian place for dinner. And literally every curry that they make, they have cashew nuts in. Yeah. And our man Archer is allergic to cashew nuts. Yeah, so the only thing he can have inside of there is like naan by itself. Which so now we're anyway, so. <laughs> white people. Yeah. So now we're looking for an Indian restaurant that makes curries without having cashew nut in it. And there's like none at the moment. Yikes. Three days later. We found a restaurant that will make cur curries without the allergic stuff in it. So now we're gonna have Indian food. For starters, we got ch chicken drumsticks, but they have an Indian name that I just don't remember, but we'll call them chicken drumsticks. They're very hot, let's see how they are. I have to do. Hmm? I have to do. It tastes, it tastes like tandoori chicken, but on a drumstick. Give it a go. Okay. Good. It's just chicken with Indian masalas on. So. This is the most important thing at an Indian restaurant, which is their mango lassi. So we'll try it together. Let's go. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers. Oh, wait. There we go. That is definitely way better than the last mango lassi I had. It's good. The only thing that could take it up a notch is some ice cubes in there to make it colder. Just ice, oh. ice cubes. Yeah, ice cubes. Like Other than that, with the garlic naan, butter naan, butter chicken. And of course, Dal Makhni. I'll let you guys know how it goes. Whoa, my group is on 5%, but huge shout out to uh, Tandoori Hut. It's Tandoori Hut in Thomastown. The food was really great. Uh, but best of all, the chef, was, the chef was so nice and welcoming. He just made the whole experience so good. But I'm really tired now, gonna go home and sleep. I say that every time, and uh, yeah. And then you stay up. Yep. Yeah. Welcome back, uh, I'm home. Archer showed me this like nighttime routine that's supposed to make you sleep easier or better. It's just like sensory deprivation. So basically you dim all the lights in the house and I'm just gonna walk around with a flashlight. And then he's doing this, which actually is just the opposite of sensory deprivation. Yeah, well, the YouTube needs light. So I'm basically just gonna brush my teeth wash my face and then go to bed. But I'm telling you this now, because when I do it in darkness, you might not be able to see it. No, I will be, I'm so tired. <laughs> so yeah, let's brush my teeth.